love him for the for the ugly flower couch. <laughs> 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 Don't do it for the furniture, Amanda. We were in line behind a couple at the grocery store, and they were talking about, you know, getting divorced and getting remarried. And the woman said, yeah, well, first time around you marry for love, the second time around you marry for major appliances. He had all of his. <laughs> That's great. Uh, yeah, he... If you had a washer and dryer, you'd be that much more attractive. You'd be the prince of the city, baby. <laughs> Well, Mimi, I guess we ought to we ought to head home pretty soon. Yeah. Go see if Harry's actually doing what he's supposed to do. Yeah. Well, what's that? His homework. He has been screwing around all day. He has a lot to do, but he, and he had, was doing his history. Yeah, but he yeah, but half the day he hadn't done anything. Yeah, I know he hadn't downloaded my iTunes onto the new computer. Those <laughs> oh. are the important things. It he didn't just come with it. My iTunes account to put on the new computer. So. Authorize it. Uh, authorize it usually pretty quick. So he's going to put put it on your iPod and then load it into the new computer from your iPod. Well, he's using my iPod as a great big uh, memory stick. Right. Right. Or whatever. transferring music. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Right. Yes, we finally updated our, our computer stuff. After uh, so we had to, John assures us we've had the same old computer since. 2001. <laughs> so it's uh, it was, was dated. Yeah, it's that way. And slow. Now we have a new desktop and a laptop, and we actually have wireless that's, internet. Yeah, that's right. So it was a big So we're very us. modern. Yes. Cool. Yes, it was very exciting. Well, actually, Harry <coughs> hooked it up. But then I was setting up my email, and it said, You're password is this, but you really should change it to a different password. So I said, okay, so I put in a new password. Well, that messed up the new router and everything, and I knew Harry was going to yell at me because he told me, don't mess with the internet, Mom. So I had to call and get tech support and talk to this really nice Indian woman whom I really had a hard time understanding, but oh after an hour we finally got it set up. So An hour? Yes. You mean she actually sounded Indian? Well, she she wasn't was. an Indian woman, you know, trying to ask you how the cards were doing. Yeah. And who My name is Jack Clark. Clark. Oh, yeah, she yeah. talked to some guy who said his name was Jack Clark. <laughs> sure it is. This was years ago. <laughs> Now, this lady was very nice, but she kept saying, what word was it? Dot. I couldn't understand when she said dot, and I wasn't sure what she was telling me to do. Once we finally got past that block, it was, it was okay. Was it that? <coughs> no, it was the word dot. Oh, okay. Like I was typing oh, dot. something okay. in, I guess. And, oh, okay. Uh, you Quite wouldn't think that would be a hard word to understand, and maybe that wasn't the one, but it was something really simple like that. Well, Quite some time, uh, Xerox replacement parts were getting shipped to high-tech care of David Al Alice. <laughs> 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 I think once or twice I'd already even spelled it out for them, and, because they'd asked me to, and it still was coming out A-L-L-I-S. <laughs> At least it wasn't A-L-I-C-E. Well, we we have uh, something uh, in uh, our firm called a high net worth visit, okay, or a home office visit, and people bring in high net worth clients, or they bring in CPAs or attorneys. We're going to refer people to them, and this broker from Texas, which is a foreign country in itself, brought in an Indian CPA, and so. I was in there talking about retirement plans, and the Indian CPA was talking about his clients. And I was doing fine, because, you know, once you kind of surrender to it, you can understand what he's saying. Well, I left, and the broker came with me and says, Man, I can barely understand that guy sometimes. But you're the one who paid to bring him in, <laughs> and you're <laughs> expecting him to refer clients. What kind of clients do you think he's going to have? Mm -hmm. 
He says, I couldn't believe you could just understand what he was saying. <laughs> Actually, I have a harder time understanding my nephew from Texas than my Indian <laughs> woman. Oh. David had trouble when we moved to Tennessee for that year. <laughs> the science teacher was talking about how we were going to start the sale um, in the... <laughs> October, I think it was. I'm like, what sale? What are we selling? Oh, no. The human body sale. <laughs> this is a strange school, guys. <laughs> David, I don't get that. Maybe it's because uh, I'm not Catholic or something. <laughs> but what, what, what does he mean? The, 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 the sale. Yeah, the oh, the sale. Yeah. The sale. Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Sale. Sale. To make up your own. Yeah. 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 It wasn't until she said human body sale, and it took me a moment after that till it clicked. Oh, sell. C E L L. There is no yeah, long just, A. I just think she, she just, just says to surrender to those things, you know. And once you do, and you can relax. Right. You can understand what people context. are saying. It depends. It's all context. Yeah, but well, when you're but trying to do something on the computer that you're not comfortable with anyway, I couldn't relax. I was so nervous anyway. Say, so can you spell that? <laughs> T H A T. <laughs> yes. Railroad co crossing. Look out for the cars. Can you spell that without any R's? T H A T. Sitting over at Creek Court Park on, on top of the kayak when I was wearing my um, knee brace. This, this big black guy came along the path and, and said something to me, and I was like, What? And he was African, and it didn't even sound like he was speaking English to me. <laughs> mm -hmm. And unfortunately, his, after I asked what several times, his companion said he's asking if, if he can pray for your knee. Wow. Aww. So absolutely. I, I, I thought it was really nice, and I said, yeah, that would be great, thinking you'd go home and pray for my uh -oh. knee. No, no, right there. They right came, there. They came over and, you know, stood in front of me, and he, he, he like, held up his hand, and he's, he's, you know, praying that my knee, that I would experience a miracle, you know. Oh, we pray that, that this woman will experience a miracle of having her knee fixed and healed, you know, <laughs> in your name, and, you know, this and that, and he, he went on for about five minutes, oh and, and praying for a miracle, and at the end he asked me if I knew Jesus, and I said yes. About a personal nice friend, no doubt. It was really nice of him to want to pray for my knee. Mm. I was like, that's really sweet. <laughs> so did your, has your knee gotten better? <laughs> so. Yes, it doesn't feel like a miracle, though. <laughs> Well, now well, God works in mysterious ways. It's a slow miracle. It's a slow acting miracle. Incremental. Yes. Well, we, we've had some prayers that did recently that didn't go too well. Oh, my gosh. When Dad was dying, he, uh, he was in the hospice, and they called and said, well, his breathing has really changed. Well, they had said that twice already. And I was at school, and I was going to go to school that day, and then take off the Friday, and I said, well, I don't know what to think. And I called Tina, and I said, Tina, they said that his breathing has changed, but they've said that before. What do you think? She said, well, his hands are cold. I said, I'll be right there. Yeah. So Harry and I rushed on up there, and... We knew it was very close, and Cindy and Tina and I are standing around the bed. And so Tina wanted to say a prayer. Well, Tina's the only one of us who's religious, and she's saying this prayer. And, it's and a long it, ass It's prayer. a long one, and she's going on, and I can just, I'm trying not to look at Cindy, because I can feel Cindy just looking daggers at Tina for this long, long prayer. <laughs> and I'm standing there, and, and, and God... God, please take our daddy and please, please take him home to you. And he stopped breathing. And 
Like she said, said <laughs> Tina killed Dad. No, she said she said you killed Dad. <laughs> and so then we kind of laughed and, well, because and, and Tina, Cindy, Tina oh, killed Cindy Dad. Said, and Cindy said right after she said you killed Dad. Cindy said, "Don't pray in my direction." <laughs> and, and then everybody laughed. And so laughed. then we're laughing about oh. it. And then a few seconds later, Dad. Snorts and he starts breathing again. We said, ah, he's going out on his terms, not because you asked God to take him now. And then a couple of minutes later, he did Aww. pass away. <laughs> kind of broke the tension of the moment. Yeah, I, 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 Mia just said, you killed Dan. <laughs> I think he was just faking it so you guys would be able to have your lines there. <laughs> oh, man. Oh.